So, I'm interested to see what they're... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Sriracha mayo, that is. Here we go. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. We are here in Newcastle at Cafe Garage. Um, <laughs> we're not. <laughs> where are we? The garage cafe. The garage cafe. Is that over there, Ron? Anyway, let's crack on. <laughs> Jess lost the plot here. <laughs> I was so energetic as well, wasn't I? Where I'm from. <laughs> Sorry, carry on. I've got all red. <laughs> um, let's just let's, let's plow, plow on with it. Anyway, Callum found this place on on the line. He found this on on the web, uh, and it looks great. Turned up, and it's like it's a bit of a rare one. Obviously, it was an old garage. The other side of the forecourt there, we've got like the, where the pumps would be. To the left of it is the, the spray hoses, whatever you want to call them. The vac. Um, <laughs> and inside, I've lost the player now today. And inside, it's got a mini on the wall, a disco balls, tyres laying around, and a counter selling the most glorious cakes, food, and hopefully coffee, latte, two sugars, up she gets. Legit amazing coffee. They had a fancy coffee machine, didn't they? Yes, they did. Very fancy. Great team as well. Just got super helpful. Needed a wee wee. Let me behind the counter to go for a, a wee wee. It sounds very French, doesn't it? Needed a wee wee baguette. Um, anyway, look, let's cut to the chase. We've got a video sponsor as well, which is great. CP Packaging. You guys, major sponsor of our page. Um, I'm not going to like bagging them out, but if you want to get branded packaging to elevate yourself. CP Packaging are the guys to talk to. The whole design process, where from start to finish, they can help you with that. Everything they're doing has got an environmental twist. It really is a great business for us to be working with. So much synergy. So if you're watching this as a takeaway owner, and think, do you know what? I need a new packaging supply. These work all around the UK, and I think they would love to help you as part of the extended FRC army. Now, Jessica, I want to show you, I want to go back to front here. I want to show you what caught my eye inside. All right. If this isn't the best looking chuffin muffin, chuffin muffin? Oh, my words today. <laughs> if this is if this, the best looking chuffin muffin I've ever seen in my life, look at that. How what do you good like is that? About it? Just the little orange bits around. It's a Terry's chocolate orange, gluten free muffin. It feels so dense. That looks so sugary and delicious. I'm going to smash my lips all around that. Excuse the wind, everyone. We've got Storm, Storm Newcastle on the go at the moment. Can I leave that with you, Jessica, so it doesn't blow away into Cafe Garage? <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Okay, so the menu. <coughs> typical, uh, typical sort of calf menu. Bacon, etc., etc. One thing that did really sh uh, stand out was a toasty. I think a toasty might be the OG, I don't know what you think, Callum, the OG original snack. Like, so. it's the legend, it's legendary. And I think, I think toasty's gonna come back. So, I'm interested to see what they've, oh, wow. Woo. Oh, wow. Sriracha mayo, that is. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, big, it's clumbersome. It's, it's heavy. <laughs> Good bread. Right, here we go. Good crunch. I don't know what it is about cheese toasty, but... It just hits the spot. Like, whoa! Great toasting. Super fluffy bread on the inside with a, a big old fat chunk of cheese in the middle. Come on. Sriracha mayo. Does that work? I think it does. The cheese has got a kind of nice mature flavour to it, but not too much. You know, it's just like... Works really well. Cheese toasty. On point, more than on point. Wow. 
Sriracha works. Have a potato pita. Now. I want more of that cheese toast straight away. <laughs> that cheese toasty is taking my mind into the 10th dimension. Wow. LSD cheese. Now, Ooh. we've got a steak burger, Jess. Oh my God. Steak burger with a little side of Krispy Krispies. What a genius way of like, not wanting to do chips, but don't want to just sell it on its own. Oh, yeah. That's smart cookies. I feel like that top bun doesn't go with the bottom bun. It's like that bottom bun is really long and thin. You've got a mismatch. Don't know. Anyway, come on, let's cut to the chase. You that attack, maybe? You really followed that under you then. There we go. This is the steak burger. Nicely toasted, as you can see. Doesn't look like a piece of steak. It looks more like a burger, so... I'm not sure what they're playing out there, to be like honest. Steak mince. Do you think it was actually going to be steak? What else is it going to be, then? What? And mince the fur. It's the meat, <laughs> the steak. All right, I, I get it. All of it's called steak, though, is it? Okay, all right. I might be wrong. No, I'm I thought it was a piece of steak, like yeah. sirloin yeah. or something, rump or something into a burger, but that's okay. Look, we move. Bit of mayo at the bottom. Nice little bit of salad. Good toasting. Brioche bun. Fairly Billy Basic bun. Is it going to hold up to it? Probably. Just trying to figure out my angle of attack there. <laughs> it's all about what angle you attack it from. Straight away, pickle. Great flavour. So yeah, I think if you wanted a, a snacky burger, that would hit the spot. I mean, in the burger leagues of the UK, it's probably not there, but this is a great venue. The cheese toasty, four quid. That was exceptional. Genuinely, like they've nailed the flavour profile of that. Sriracha mayo on the side, genius. The burger was okay. Good, good flavour. Great, it's a great burger. Just probably not in the elite category. Um, but taking nothing away from it for eight quid, uh, they've done all right. Now, this is probably, hopefully, what people are still here for. <laughs> Bloody gluten free muffin. Jess. Sorry. Jess, come on now. Sorry. Don't, don't disrespect the, the diarrhea crew. <laughs> Here we go, Jess. Now, this looks great. Let me break into it and let's see if the, the lack of... Glutes. Uh, glutes. <laughs> Here we go. Does it taste as good as it looks? It's quite dense. And my mouthful had one of the two pieces of a chocolate on top, which made it very, very nice. Look at it out. And it's still very, very nice. Good. Good muffin. Good muffin, good latte, good toasty, good times, good people, good garage, good fun. Good Newcastle, <laughs> nine out of 10, good score. How about that? Newcastle, thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed any part of this review, hit the like button, please. Uh, give it a share on your socials, post it in an email, whatever you need to do, get it out there. If you're watching on all the other platforms, hello. Hope you guys are all doing great. I oh, enjoyed that one. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Back. Trying to find a flavor that's got you people licking your lips, checking the dips. We're checking out the best of the bunch so you can get your best breakfast, dinner, or lunch. It's Matt D and Jess coming with the food review. We've been traveling, trying to find the best foods for you. Yeah, now that's a review.